What's up guys, Ed here again. Um, let me show you guys what we've been up to. Uh, so if you haven't seen the Culinator video yet, um, check it out. It's cool. But I'm going to show you guys something cooler. So uh, as photographers, we mainly use um, Lightroom. Uh, most of us anyways use Lightroom, the Adobe software. So uh, what we're going to do is... We're going to make your life a little easier, okay, by, um, with this, actually. So, same, same controller, okay, but as you can see, we're not on Photo Mechanic anymore. We're on uh, Lightroom, and if you can tell, we are on the develop mode. So, keep in mind that this controller... Okay, uh, also works on develop mode. So if you work on develop mode or on library mode, I'm sorry, uh, it'll work just fine. Um, but we're in the develop mode so I can actually show you guys um, the sliders. Because these guys are a lifesaver, but at the same time, they're a pain in the ass. Because uh, editing one photo is cool. A number of photos is okay, but a crap load of photos sucks. So um, we're going to take you guys away from the keyboard and bring you guys into something way more ergonomic. So how we've designed the software is um, basically you could uh, program any of these keys into any of these sliders so anything that you see here uh, temperature 10 exposure recovery fill light blacks uh, everything you could read uh, you know what's up in there uh, so this is Lightroom 3 we're also doing Lightroom 4 so you know don't fret I'm just showing you guys this that it is possible check this out okay uh, so my workflow, how I like it is these two top buttons right here is going to be my temperature. So if you can see my temp and button one, I'm going to make it, the thing warmer. You see that? You see how the numbers is going higher? And we're going to make it lower. Okay. Higher lower so you can kind of see it like moving up and down you can see the number going up and going down same here with brightness okay uh, brightness up brightness down uh, let's see if we could show you guys both and the same screen All right. brightness up brightness down so um, let me put the uh, camera down real quick and I'm gonna try to show you guys <clears throat> um, all right you guys can you guys see the controller all right check this out um, temperature up you see it dude you can see the um, photo getting way warmer and then I can actually go ahead and cool it down way way down way way down and way way down or we could do brightness up um, brightness down brightness up brightness down you see that so these guys right here I programmed these to be my vibrance uh, vibrance um, so I can make this very bright, vibrant, very vibrancy, or very less vibrancy. You see that? Alright, these guys right here are my blacks. Um, way, way, way black. Black into time. And way, way less black. So basically, you can see that 
we can totally edit photos just by using this. See? All right, now what I'm gonna do is show you guys how fast this thing is now, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go edit a few photos for you guys, okay? So let's start off with the jumping photos. All right, I'm gonna make it a little warmer, a tad warmer, a little brighter, okay? Next one, same thing, a little bright. And then increase the vibrance. There you go. Increase the vibrance. A little less bright. Doot. Doot. Alright. See, now I need to get a faster computer because um, I'm actually able to work way faster than the computer now. Uh, there you go. More. A little higher. And next. Little, let's make it a little brighter. Okay, next. So basically, you can actually see how, um, I don't know, it's a very exciting tool. Uh, the combination of having a super ergonomic controller uh, and being able to uh, edit your photos is amazing you no longer have to be stuck in front of these and as you can tell I'm not even using a mouse right uh, so what you want to do as far as like cropping and stuff uh, that's gonna be way later this is just um, uh, just the basic editing tool which is basically for me 90% of um, what we do anyways um, and as far as cropping, uh, you can just tag your photos to crop later and, you know, just go through every single photo that needs cropping. Uh, but as far as, like, going through all these photos, um, I think this is all you need for now. So, yeah, uh, this is still in beta mode. We're still, t you know, fixing the bugs, but as you can see, it's running pretty damn smoothly now. Um, it's pretty pretty cool, man. So check it out, Cullinator.com. Um, check us out at WPPI and um, say hi. Uh, we're on booth something something. Uh, I'll list it below because I can't remember. But yeah, Cullinator, editor. Lightroom, photo mechanic, check it. Alright, peace guys.